Hey guys, I'm back. <laughs> um, so I wanted to get on here and talk about a couple things, but first, let's go work out. for watching my workout. So the reason I wanted to work out prior to getting on here and talking to you guys is because, yes, my hair is a mess from my workout, that happens, <laughs> um, is because I had so much running through my mind. Um, do I start at the beginning where, you know, do I start, at, I just don't even know where to start, you know? And so the best advice I received after watching some YouTube YouTube tutorials is just to start. It doesn't have to be perfect. Um, 
And just like fitness, you don't have to be perfect to do it. You don't have to be a certain size to do it. It starts with moving your body. It starts with walking or, you know, it just starts at the beginning. Start at the beginning. <laughs> just start, you know, don't wait. Stop waiting around. Stop waiting for the perfect moment. Stop waiting for you to have more time with your family. Stop waiting on your job. Stop waiting. Just freaking start. Start at the beginning. Um, and this was my beginning of my new journey. I've gone through plenty of journeys before, um, but I felt like this one has challenged me the most in all aspects because now I have four kids instead of three. Um, my youngest prior to having her was four. So I had a lot more time on my hands and I wasn't working and you know, more things that come into our life, more challenges and sometimes fitness becomes something we do on the back burner, but we cannot let that happen, right? Right. In the beginning, I started gaining weight when I was probably like 12 years old. I was in middle school and, you know, I was just very lazy and I just was eating the wrong things. And so weight started to pack on me. Um, I remember going to the grocery store one time with my parents and they wanted us to all pick out our own groceries. And I remember pushing my little cart around and getting donuts and cupcakes and frozen food and, and like, um, just all kinds of junk. And I remember at the end of the grocery shopping trip, my mom looked at my cart and she's like, I'm disappointed in you. And I'm like, why? Like, this is what I eat. She's like, you, you have to choose to eat better. You have to choose to eat better things for your body. And I never knew what that really was. Um, and so from that point, when I was in middle school, I went into a nutrition class. You know, they teach you the basics of taking care of your body. And I remember just falling in love with it. And I was like, wow, I, I like absorbed every little thing that it said. You know, it talked about fruits and vegetables and exercise and how long to exercise for. And I remember just soaking it up as a kid and being like, I love this and I want to change my body. Um, my mom, you know, when I was younger, obviously, <laughs> I, we were sitting in the, in the jacuzzi one time and she wanted to have a talk with me and she said, I didn't, she didn't want to hurt me in any way, but she says, I don't want you to end up like me. Um, because she was very obese and she wasn't living her life to the fullest. She's like, I don't want you to end up like me. I want you to have a healthy, long life. And sorry, I get really emotional when I think about it, but her love changed my actions from that point on. Um, she had purchased a treadmill. She had never used it herself. Let's be honest. She, she never ended up getting on it, but I did. And I remember running like 30 minutes after school every single day. Um, I was in cheerleading and I would run up and down the block. I would create my own workouts. I, when everyone was doing free time for PE, I would actually go work out. I would go do lunches across the field and do push-ups and sit-ups and everything that they were teaching me in middle school. I would do those things. And eventually, I lost 25 pounds in middle school on my own. I had nobody telling me how to do this. I figured it out for myself. And um, that's why I want to do these YouTube videos because I know I'm able to help other people who are in the same situation that don't understand, even know where to start. Um, and I hope I can help people do that.